Hi everyone, my name is Lynette Chandler from Thrive Anywhere and today I want to show you how to take a free journal and make it fillable using a free tool. Now there's nothing you need to download with this free tool, the only thing you need to download is the free journal and I'm going to show you where to get it and how to use it and you can take this free journal and sell it to your customers, whether it's on Etsy or your own store and all that, and make it valuable by making it fillable and also serve two types of uh, people. One who likes to print out the journal and the type of people who like to fill it in on a computer. Okay, ready to get started? Here we go. So let me share my screen here for a second. All right, what you should see now on my screen is the site or the tool that we're going to use to uh, make the fillable PDF. But first of all, what you need to do is you need to grab the free item, okay? And let's go ahead and head to uh, my site here, which is thriveanywhere.com. And if you would go to, okay, this is the shop, not the right place. If you go to freebies, you will find a list of freebies that we have available for you that you can take and sell and make it fillable if you want to. You can do this process for any of the free products that we have here for you. But for today, what I'm gonna show you is to use this one good thing, one line a day memory journal. You just need to click that and then order it. It's a free item and you will get to the downloadable item. Now. What I'm showing you right now is not to change the colors and edit the design, okay? If you want to do that, the product comes with the editable InDesign and also the editable PowerPoint. Most people don't use the Adobe products, but I include it because it is one of the more popular um, tools out there. But if you use PowerPoint, uh, you would still need two of these things to make it editable, okay? The PowerPoint version is you want to go in there to change the colors, make, change the design, and even the font. And then you save it as a PDF, and then you upload it to Seshta, which is the tool to use to make it fillable. Okay, so I hope I haven't confused you. But... So let's take, for example, once you've downloaded, you make it your colors, you change the fonts, and you add maybe a welcome page or whatever you want to add into uh, your design, you make it into a PDF file. And I already have the PDF file. And I'm going to click that link. Again, you just go to seshda.com. It is completely free. You can upload it if you want to, but it's totally optional. and it's very affordable. So you click the edit PDF and then you upload the PDF file. Now I have made two types of PDFs and actually the uh, product comes with a PDF already made. This is the ready-made PDF. So if you're not really going to uh, change the design, you just want to go ahead and, and sell it as is, you can do that, but I would highly recommend that you do change the design. Okay, so I'm going to select that product and click open now it will open up like this all right if you want to you can if you just want to take it and run with it real quickly and easily you can go ahead and add an image or your whatever your logo is and you can put it here for example let's assume that's your logo you can put it right there now here comes the important thing that you want to know how to make it fillable because right now it's not so let's look at lick <laughs> I can't speak today. Let's take a look at the things or the fields or the areas that I want people to be able to fill in. So under month, of course, that's pretty yeah, that's pretty self-explanatory that we want to go ahead and allow to, uh, people to add a month there to whatever month that they are filling in. So I click on forms and this should only be a single line item. So I'm going to click that. And I'm going to place it right here. Actually, oh, I'm going to place it like that. 
Okay, it really doesn't matter. You can place it however you want because you're going to change the size of it anyway. So you change the size of it and then you can just, again, set it however you want. And the next thing I'll do is I'm going to do a form and I'm going to click on multiple areas and I'm going to put it right there because this is where people are going to put in their one item a day that they learned how to do. And what I'm going to do is not the border color, maybe the border color. I'm going to change it to match with a, my design, which is very pink. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select a color from the document right here. And actually, I've never done it. Okay, I'm going to select and drag, I think. Huh. I've never done this one before, so I'm not sure why it does that. Okay, let me just go for red, okay? And I, I don't think I make the background change. So I don't want to do this for every single line that we have. We've got 30 lines on this document here, rather 31. So I don't want to do every single one. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy. And Seshta makes it super easy to copy. And I'm just going to place this one right here in number two. Okay. And in fact, it can. If we want to, you can make it, oh, okay, we've already changed it, so we can't zoom it. So maybe you want to zoom it before you want to make the changes, and then duplicate again, and then place it where you want people to fill in. In this case, it's pretty self-explanatory. The bad thing about Sejda is it doesn't have a uh, snap, so you just have to eyeball everything and make sure that they kind of like you could make the whole the whole spot here editable but that would defeat the design of this because it's just meant to fill in one day at a time all right so assuming that we've filled all of this um, you've made all of these items fillable we are ready to apply and we go ahead and apply changes see as i was doing this it has already asked me um to because I've done uh, three tasks in one hour because I was testing a few things. So you will have um, this kind of limit on you on a free account. No big deal. We just wait for the 30 minutes to pass and then we can go ahead and do this. Or you can just do a upgrade to remove this limitation. And really it's just $5 for a week. So if you want to batch process. For example, you want to go ahead and do all of your PDF journals, all of your PDF planners, make them all PDF. And then for the next week that you're ready to make them fillable, you can go ahead and order it $5 for one week. And for that one week, that's your entire goal. To make all of your PDFs fillable. And then all you need to do is five dollars and i think you can also upgrade for a year for 63 dollars which is really pretty affordable so we'll just go ahead and wait um, the 37 minutes or 27 minutes and uh, we'll come back to it and basically what happens is that once you have that done let me go ahead and find that oh actually i put it in trash okay so this is my pdf a fillable PDF which I had created earlier and I'm just gonna double click to open it. Okay, I gotta to move it to my uh, folder here. Let me move it first. Whoops. And where did I move it to? I think, okay. All right, so I'm gonna upload it. And as you can see, I already filled it in. See, I filled it in here today, what I've done, and it's April, I filled in the month, and it's already saved it in for me. And then the next day I can um, fill it in again. Maybe something I did win, made, 
a hundred dollars in whoops, not hundred a hundred dollars in sales, for example. And then we will save it or duplicate and save it, and then it will be uh save. And then people can fill it in right here and keep it on their computers or wherever they, they want to, for example. And then now if I close this, I'm just, this, just gonna show you the concept. And if I reopen this again, there it is. So my items are all saved and people can come in and delete it and change it, whatever. And basically they can reuse this and you'll make it a reusable journal. So I hope this has been really helpful for you. Thank you very much for your attention. I'll see you the next time. Bye-bye.